Hello. Hello. Uh, so uh, today I'm going to demonstrate how we can use a smart parking demo set. Uh, so in the package, in the in the suitcase you receive, you will include in the following item: uh, the mouse, okay, of course, uh, the key to start the emission of the power supply, and a couple cards, and also. Um, there are some of the dummy license plate that we're going to use for uh, license plate recognition demo. Yeah, and also there are a couple RFID, right? That's used for a uh, car swiping demonstration. So basically, this demo set uh, include all the uh, parking infrastructure infrastructure uh, function there. Right. So um. A couple of things. Let's start with the demo first. Uh, the the power to power up the system uh, to fully power up the system take about five to six minutes. So I suggest you can start earlier. Right. And we turn this switch to on, so its power is on, and use this key to insert to. Uh, here and turn to ignition. So once you turn to ignition, you will start countdown process. Uh, once it reaches zero, it will start powering up. So in the meantime, during the power power sequence, we pull this platform up. Okay. So there are two handles here, right? To pull this hand. And be careful with the cable. Don't cut the cable, right? So to fully this platform and then next uh, you can find a, a cable a USB cable down here uh, and you need to connect this cable to one of the USB port okay there we go and then uh, in the meantime uh, you can hook up the mouse uh, during demo you don't need the mouse but during setup, you are going to need the mouse. So that's why I'm using the mouse right now. Okay. There you go. Okay. So since this is still in boot up, booting up, uh, let me doing some uh, some of the side work. So um, we can put the license plate on the car like this. Oh. One of the scenario is that you can put the car here. The uh, camera will take the image of the license plate, and if it's in in the database, you will turn the gate open. Right. So we can put a couple license plate onto the car. Right. And one. Let me show you what's the difference between them. For the license plate, if the back is blank. That means it's not in the database. If there is a mark here, that means it's uh, this license plate is within the database. So you can use this license plate to open the gate. So let's set up then. Set them up. Okay. Same thing for the RX RFID. So the cross one shows uh, this one is embedded, and this one is a embedded card to open the gate. Right. Uh, so since it's still in powering up, so let me talk about a uh, couple different scenarios within this demo. So uh, this is the parking infrastructure. The first demo you, you we can show is that uh, the plate. Uh, play recognition from this camera and the second one uh, is the RFID identification through this reader and also whenever you swipe the card right the camera will take the, the picture of the person that's swiping this card right it's the same thing you're going to show in the in the screen and also uh, it's able to demo 
the a mechanical sensor, uh, the mechanic magnetic sensor under the parking infrastructure. So when you put in the card here, as you can see, there is a, a red dot there, right? That means that it's identified there is a car above it, and on the screen, it will show the the that particular spot is being occupied. Yeah. <coughs> So let's wait a little bit longer for the system to power. Okay, I guess not. Uh, okay, so uh, once it's power up. Right, start from the GeoVision GVMVR system. Right, uh, there is a sequence to turn on the uh the program, so we need to turn it down one by one. Okay, the start with GeoVision GVMVR system. Double click it. Right. Okay. I guess system is not fully boot up, so let's see it's uh, slower. Yeah. So uh, the GeoVision GVMVR system is actually a uh, software from GeoVision, and it's a it's a central control for the camera for the uh, POE camera they have. Right. So within this system, you will be able to see the. Uh, video stream from the two camera. Yeah. Okay, there we go. So as you can see, the camera one is this one. This camera uh, is uh, facing directly to the entrance of the parking lot. Uh, the car is here. Okay, yeah. And then on the right hand side, this one is the RFID detection camera. Right. Okay, so after this program started, right, um, Usually I wait for a couple minutes before I move on to the next software. Um, for some reason I notice there, sometimes there may be some software glitch uh, if you do it too fast. Um, and uh, we, we are not sure where the problem is. Uh, but uh, I notice if we wait uh, a couple, like one or two minutes after the, this program shows up, and then uh, it, it can actually minimize the chance you see this glitch. So, right, you need to uh, press on the, this, this power button right, to minimize this software. Minimize this software. Okay. And then uh, we need to turn, uh, open this AS Manager software. Right. So, uh, the previous software is actually. Uh, uh, civilian software that's uh, uh, pu pulling the video feed from camera. Uh, AS Manager software is the software that's actually with the database, with the scanned uh, data entries and everything. So this is the management software. Okay. So don't maximize it. All right, we just turn it down. So we uh from monitor, new LPR monitor, turn it down. Okay, 
as you can see, it, there are history of here, right? Plates recognize unregistered cam vehicle, plate, plate recognize a registered vehicle, okay? Uh, and pull, uh, click on the auto select. So make sure you will keep uh, the latest entry on the top. And change to thumbnail. Uh, okay, so you can see the picture here. All right, and then so this this actually the part of the um, uh, license plate uh, demo uh, recognition demo, and then we turn uh, the new parking monitor. Uh, right, turn this on. New parking monitor here. All right. So. Sorry. Uh, let me see. Access monitor. Oh, there we go. Sorry, it's actually uh, the access monitor. Yeah. All right. So as you can see, it's actually RFID. Uh, the door one refers to the parking gate entrance as well. So, uh, try not to do the demo of the license plate recognition and also the RFID uh, demo at the same time, uh, because they open the same gate. Right. Sometimes it's very confusing. Again, uh, press on um, auto select and uh, change to uh, thumbnail. Yeah. So we need to move this a little bit. Right. So make sure uh, in the demo we can see that correctly. All right. And then um, let's minimize it. Right. And we turn on the EMAP view. Okay. So it will turn on this uh, like blank stuff here. All right. Move this window over here. Okay. And uh, click on the new map. And uh, drag the everything to the very right. Okay. And pull this thing down here. All right. Okay. And move. Let's put this right here. And then uh, let's move back to the asset manager. Okay. All right. So let's maximize it. All right. All right. As you can see, due to the uh, screen size, we really uh, have limited space to demo. All right. But let's move a little bit to like this. Okay. So let's do this. So if we are uh, taking one of the uh, the car with registered uh, license plate uh, put on here. Right. So as you can see, it's there is an update. Right. Uh, I think right. It's not recognized. Uh, it's recognized wrongly. Right. Okay. But I think it's because our tech is a little bit. Let me try a different tag. That right? Okay. Right. If we put it right here, as you can see, you recognize the tag correctly, and it's within registry uh, vehicle. It open the gate, right? And you move the car to the position number two. It automatically show that uh, the P two is occupied. Right. Right here. And what happens if we use another vehicle that is not registered? Okay, so as you can see, this tag is blank at the back, so it's not registered uh, license plate. Right. So if we park, the, we move the car here, right, and it's showing uh, this license plate being recognized, but the vehicle is inv invalid, right? So the gate will not open. So that's pretty much about the demo for the uh, plate license, uh, license plate recognition, right? So let's move on to the uh, right hand side is for the RFID, okay? Okay. Right. Yeah. Usually, let me let me shift it, a little, make it larger, so you can see, so you can remove the mouse after this. Right, so 
for example, uh, if we use this unregistered card, right, to swipe the RFID ID reader, it actually taking the picture of the person who swipe it, and also uh, showing access denied, right? Okay. right? So if we I use different card, this card is registered, right? I swipe it, right? Okay, so the gate open. And also, uh, the person who swiped this card is also recorded. Right. So that's the second part, it's actually the RFID recognition, which is very common in the uh, smart parking infrastructure. Uh, the third part, which we already mentioned, is the um, underground magnetical, mag magnetic sensor. So if you put the car, uh, on the parking lot, right? Make sure the car with foil this side is on top of this little bump here. Okay, so when you put it up, our system is able to recognize uh, there is a car that on the on this particular spot and uh, showing the status of the uh, occupancy of the parking lot. Yeah, that's about that's pretty much about the demo. Uh, you can play around uh, to show the customer. Right. Next, um, very important, how to turn it down. Right. Uh, don't stop here. Please finish the whole video, how to turn it off. Right. So uh, we first, same sequence, we turn off this software. Uh, it's a parking structure management software. Right. Turn it off first and uh, turn off the LS manager and then uh, okay. then we can go shut down the system okay shut shut down the system okay uh, while it's shutting down there is a thing uh, let's remove the vehicle um, you need to remove of course the mouse uh, the mouse probably going to be removed after you set it up but next you need to remove the USB cable here, right? Otherwise, when you lower the platform, it's going to uh, probably damage the cable. Right? So put the cable here, and uh, slightly, slowly push down this platform, right? And make sure when you push it down, doesn't uh, damage the cable on the side. Right? A little bit. we go up and uh, start packing your stuff right. RFID the tag right. and uh, very important after this shutdown uh, very important the key well if we lost the key this demo key is kit is useless and put everything here right the car you can put it in here and uh, yeah, shut down and and put in a po uh, power cable inside the kit, putting everything back to the kit. And that's pretty much the demo. Right. Thank you.